The chief of staff in the Tanzanian army has said 20 people were killed in a series of explosions at an ammunition depot in the city of Dar es Salaam. A military spokesman said the blasts were accidental. Russian police have raided the offices of a construction company run by the country's richest woman. I love this British lady, but man, does she deliver some bad news sometimes. Lighten up, lady. What a bummer. The colorful ceremony has taken Bombing place system. in Bangladesh. I love this stuff. Good morning. This is Kurt with Outer Beaches Realty Hatteras Island, and we are about to take a look at the beach here at uh, Blue Sea Road here in Rodanthe. And uh, it's not much of a road actually. You just take Blue Sea, and it kind of just cuts off. And here you are at the beach. Uh, this is more of the road. It takes a little right, but I don't know if this is called Blue Sea Road. I think this one's Seagull. Yeah, this is Seagull. But uh, you can hear the waves. You can go look at the, uh, the spot here. We got a guy about to paddle out. I guess that technically this would be considered S turns. I call it Mirlo Beach. But um, I'm going to show you guys something. Pretty excited. Kept my surfboard fixed. The uh, airlines ruined it. This whole tail was smashed right here. I got it back yesterday. Looks good, thanks to Rasco Hunt. He always does a great job. Well, let's go take a look at the beach. Check her out. Well, back in my car now. Uh, I was gonna go look at the beach and I was doing my little spiel, but then uh, a car pulled up and believe it or not, I. I get kind of embarrassed. I'm sitting here holding a camera at myself, talking to myself, and people walk up and they're looking at me like, what the heck is that guy holding a camera at himself and talking to himself? What an idiot. Freaking embarrassing. I'm just trying to do a beach report here. Yeah. For the record, I don't always wear this hat if it's cold. Um, actually, my other job as a school cafeteria worker uh, the health code requires me to wear a hairnet, so this is actually a hairnet, not a hat. Give you guys a little walk up approach view. It's a nice warm day today. It's about 55 right now, and it should get up to mid 60s by this afternoon. And tomorrow, we should see temperatures up around 70 actually. Oh, look at this wave over here. Wow. There's no wind at all this morning. The surf was actually really good here yesterday. So was the fishing because of the lack of wind. It's just perfect to get the boats out there. We got four guys out here surfing with another guy paddling out. What a beautiful day. Give you guys a peek before this battery runs out. See that house just sitting out there kind of sideways on the beach. I heard they're selling that for about $90,000 if anyone's interested. Spot, little sandbar spot. Uh, he was just behind it. A little wave out here this morning in Rodanthe. Pretty fun. Oh, yeah, look at 
look at this one. Nice. Yeah, he's got a little barrel on his longboard. Well, that looks fun. Wish I could go surfing, but I have to go to work. And I forgot a towel anyway, so it would uh, suck to get out of the water and be all cold and wet and not have anything to dry off with. It's just an epically epical day. It's epically epical. It's epically epical day. Sunshine epics. Does anyone else think it's funny when something shocking comes on the radio, everyone, where people tend to look at the radio like, I need to get a better listen by looking at it, like like it comes out of there. Demonstrations are indeed. But everyone knows it's coming out of there. Or an area back of the country somewhere. that his uh, Gaddafi has been unable to hey, look. consolidate his power over. This is for another Time to go to work. Mainly because the east of Libya is the seat.